welcome to my channel, Bianca Skogan Beauty. I just got done with a really long day at work and I was able to go to Bath and Body Works before I got to work today because today is candle day, yay! And actually, so today is Friday, December 3rd and I think I'll be able to get this video up tonight. It'll be late. And so tomorrow is also candle day, December 4th. Also my mom's birthday. Happy birthday, mom. <laughs> so um, I wanted to be able to try to fit in an extra video and get a video up because I spent too much money on candles. Um, I love candles. I have a special love for candles because I love good smelling things. I love coming into my house when it smells good. I worked at a candle company and so I just have a special fondness for candles. So um, when I can get candles, for a good price. So these are, um, how many ounces are these? 14.5 ounce candles. Um, these three wick candles from Bath and Body Works are 14.5 ounces and you can get them for 10.25. But I found that they were more at more like $11 with tax. So I actually went to Bath and Body Works twice today. <laughs> I went once before work and then I watched, a, I watched Leah Janae's video on um, her candle haul, and then I watched um, Leora Love. Sorry, I couldn't hear what you said. Oh, that was Siri talking. Then I watched Leora Love's um, candle haul from Candle Day videos, and it made me go, wait, I wanna go back. And so uh, there is a Bath and Body Works um, within five minutes of my work, and if I have any advice for you guys, this is my advice. Go to a Bath and Body Works that is not in a mall. The Bath and Body Works that are like in strip malls are always like better stocked, better supplied, and less busy. The mall ones are always chaotic. So anyways, if you're wanting to just like go to Bath and Body Works for any reason, or if you wanna go for like semi-annual sale or candle day, strip mall Bath and Body Works. They're the best. So the one that is five minutes from my work is a strip mall one. It always has the most selection. It always is not very busy and they have the nicest employees too. So anyways, let's show you what I got. I'm gonna show you what I got on my first trip and then <laughs> the ones that I decided to get on my second trip. So when I got into the store, I, was, I, I wasn't exactly sure what kind of candles I wanted. I knew I wanted like Christmassy candles, but I wasn't sure if I wanted like pure like Christmas tree fir pine candles because those can be a little bit overwhelming. They can be a, give me a headache a little bit. So I actually told the guy, he was really nice. I, I walked in there and I was like, I'm not sure what I want. I want Christmas, but I don't exactly, you know, I, I told him exactly that. And he's like, okay, well let's, let's smell some candles, see what you want. And we kind of discovered that I really like, um, like a musky vanilla spicy scent. There can be pine in that, but I, I really like a spicy musky vanilla as well. So that's kind of what we came to the conclusion. So here we go. We have the perfect Christmas has fresh cut pine. So it does have that pine to it, but the other scents are cinnamon sugar, toasted marshmallow. So that those really with, with the pine, we have that cinnamon sugar and that the marshmallow. Mm, it really is. It's called the perfect Christmas. It is very it's a very perfect Christmas smell. It's, it's, it's able to mix all three of those together to, with that marshmallow adds that vanilla flavor. I, and the, the cinnamon, um, adds that, that warmth. I, I, I really like that one. Um, so I, I did, I smelled a ton of, uh, I have to say that I probably looked at the notes of almost all the candles in the store and I smelled probably half of the candles in the store. So I went around and around and I, and I, I really was able to take a gander at uh, all of the candles. So this one is, um, sugared snickerdoodle. Um, it says joy. It's not, that's not the name of the candle. It's just cutely decorated. And I have to admit that this one really got me with the, de the decorations. It's so pretty how it's decorated. So sugared snickerdoodle, this, um, the notes are warm spices, creamy vanilla and sugared musk. So that vanilla musk right there. Perfect. Mm, yeah. Mm -hmm. It smells like a, um, a sugar cookie or a, a, it smells like a snickerdoodle. Oh, I love that. It really smells like, um, me and my kids make sugar cookies every Christmas. And this really, it smells like that. Uh, even though this is more snickerdoodle, um, 
it just reminds me of baking cookies every Christmas with my kids. So this is, that's what that smells like. So it does still smell like Christmas to me. Okay, then I got Winter Cabin. And this one has notes of winter air, black pepper, and warm amber and cedar. So this one, it has four notes. <laughs> and it is, uh, this one is, is a little bit musky. That pepper, I didn't know if I would like it with that pepper, but it makes it a little bit like warmer and um, I don't know, it's fresh. I, I, I really like the amber in there as well. It smells manly and, and masculine, It's, but also it has a, a wintry, manly smell. I really like it. Winter Cabin, is it? This one's a very nice, masculine winter smell. Okay, then I got one that is not winter at all because I wanted to get, I didn't want to go with all winter candles because I didn't want to have 10 Christmas candles and cause I can't burn 10 Christmas candles this month. So I wanted to get some to be able to spread out throughout the whole year. So you'll see um, in the ones from the next batch as well that they're not all winter. So this is Coastal Sun. And this one has scents of fresh mandarin oranges, white jasmine petals and soft sandalwood. And this one is so cute. Look at the cute little whale. -hee -hee, I love whales. Um, Mm, this is so fresh. It smells just like mandarin oranges. Mandarin oranges and like sunshine. Oh, it's a really, a really, really nice one. And the, and the guy who helped me, he specifically picked this one out. He was, he was like telling people, this is my favorite one. And I really like this one. And I was like, well done. Give it to me. Hand it over. <laughs> I loved it. It was so good. Okay. So then we have, oh, this is a favorite. I feel like I should have picked up two of these. This one, it is Iced Vanilla Woods. And I love this one because one of you guys, I've told you guys, one of my favorite scents is lavender. And this is Iced Lavender Sweet Vanilla and Ebony Wood. So, mm, it's lavender, vanilla, and musk, basically. I really love it. I really, really like it. It's, it's, it's like, I love it because these are wintry and like Christmassy without being so obvious. Like so like a pine tree right in your face. They're just, <laughs> I really like them, really. Okay, last one from this haul. And and I really liked it because there were six in here and so I was able to, to grab six. And I was like, okay, that's all I'm getting. Just I'm gonna fill up this little, this little thing. So I did. Um, okay, then they were just putting this one out um, as I got there. So I think this is like a new one for the sale. It is the Blue Spruce and Spice. It has that blue spruce, which is like the pine tree, but the spice is what I like it. It has that undertone. So it's Blue Spruce, Nutmeg, and Warm Amber. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I really am getting that Christmas tree, but I'm also getting the spicy and the nutmeg, which is like the vanilla and... And this one, it if you like um like Christmas tree scent, you should smell this one because it is it's like a Christmas tree be of, ab above and beyond. It's really really good. Okay, so that was my first trip to Bath and Body Works, and those were sixty six dollars actually. I it was sixty six dollars with tax. So. They all, they end up being about $11 is why I'm saying that. So, you know, with taxes. Hmm? I mean, I went in person. So if you're paying for shipping, it'll be even more. But yeah, 66. So try to, it, you know, it's not really going to be 1025. Although that's Utah taxes. I'm not sure any other places in the country. Who knows? Okay, let's get you my next batch. I watched some YouTube videos and was like, had some FOMO. And I was like, I need, I need some more. I need some more. Okay. Um, so then Leah Janae was able to get this into the night one. And I actually have this in a lotion and I love it. It is such a romantic, sensual, musky smell. It is so, oh, it's really, really good. So it is sugared raspberry, velvet rose petals, sh shimmering amber, and creamy musk. And it's interesting because I usually don't like really berry smells or rosy smells. But with that amber and the musk, it goes perfectly together and it just smells divine. Amazing. 
Okay, then I got this one, also Leah Janae. Um, it is Into the Stars. And she said that this one smells like the Ariana Grande Cloud. And that is one of my favorite perfumes. So it is Bergamot Champagne Night Blooming Water Lily Pink Salted Amber. And I have to agree, it smells like the Ariana Grande Cloud. Like not identical, but enough like that it's, it's hinted at it, that I'm like, wow, you're, I'm gonna burn it and smell that. So I really like it. I, I'm excited about that one. Then this one was another one that the packaging got me. Look at those humpback whales. <laughs> okay, so this is turquoise waters. And so this was me again, trying to not just get only um, Christmas candles. And this one is Costa Waves Sparkling Bergamot Sun Dressed Drenched Musk. And this smells like summer in a jar. It is so nice. It is very fresh. It's a, it's a fresh laundry smell, but also with like beachy waves to it. I really like it. I, I feel like when we took a trip to California with my sister and I feel like it smells like the waves off of the beach, but also fresh laundry. Really nice. Okay, so last but not least, I got more of a, a spring one. And this one is pink lilac and vanilla. Again, I really like that vanilla. So this one is fresh lilac bouquets, dewy greens and vanilla blossom. I love, I love the smell of lilacs. It has this like note to it that is just like pleasing. <laughs> I just, I really like it. It smells um, delicious. I really like it. I think it, I wonder if my husband will like it. I'll just smell it. I'll just burn it in the bathtub. So <laughs> he, in when I'm in the bathroom and he won't be in here, but it's really nice. I really like it. Uh, divine. So those four were like $44. So again, what, it, you know, $11. So this is supposedly the cheapest deal of the year. I mean, sometimes I feel like they have deals where, um, like the, the other day, their Black Friday deal was buy three, get three free. So technically it's like, buy one, get one free. And these are $25. These are $24.50. So if you think about it, it's by, it's, you're getting two for the price of one. So it's about $12.50. So you're getting it for $10.25 instead of $12.50. So it's still cheaper, but it's not like outrageously amazing cheaper. So there, there are deals throughout the year that make candles pretty cheap, but um, this is the best price. But if, if you miss out on this, you're not like, there will be another good price later. <laughs> but I do have to say, when you go in store, they have like, the stores really rack up. The stores bring in tons of candles. There were, the, the, the tables were just, there were candles everywhere and they had these they had these everywhere so like when you walk in they just give you one of these they're like here you go if you fill this up hand it to us and we'll we'll uh, give you another one like they're just they're prepared they're prepared and they give you these bags these are like special like more sturdy bags to hold, hold everything in because they know that the candles are more sturdy are, are heavier so it it's a kind of a special experience to go in store so i don't know it was fun. I had a good time. It was a long day and I'm gonna now go edit this video. So I hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope that you had a really good day. And um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you like me, consider subscribing to my channel. If you want to be reminded of my videos, push the bell. And remember, most importantly, be nice to yourself because you're amazing. All right. Have a great day. Bye.